Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Dipumoni, MP, Minister of Education, Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh. Esteemed Special Guest, Major General Mohammad Moshfiqur Rahman, SGP, SUP, NDC, PSC, Vice Chancellor, Bangladesh University of Professionals. Professor Dr. Khandokar Mokaddem Hossein, Pro Vice Chancellor, Bangladesh University of Professionals. Ladies and gentlemen who have joined us here today and the ones who have joined us through the live broadcast, Assalamu Alaikum and a very good morning to you all. Model United Nations provides an outstanding opportunity for the younger generation to expand their knowledge and express themselves by visualizing a society that is both peaceful and harmonious. In the era of globalization, fostering technological innovation and promoting sustainable technological practices are some of the most innovative and practical ways to achieve a resilient economy. Especially on the post-pandemic planet, it gives, the, it gives them a platform to fight for a cause against different global challenges by combining diplomatic skills, negotiating powers, critical analysis, and honing researching capabilities. And that is why we are here as BUP Global Affairs Council, having the single goal of making every individual an effective leader. I, Alavi Raihan. And I, Rafa Rabi. Welcome you all to the closing ceremony of BUP, BUP International, International Model, Model United, United Nations, Nations Conference 2021, 2021, organized by BUP Global Affairs Council. Now, let us enjoy an audiovisual that embodies BUP Global Affairs Council as a whole. The year 2021 has been full of transitions for our world. Humanitarian crisis, global warming and devastation caused by the COVID-19 pandemic and human rights violations all have made themselves known as some of the greatest challenges of our generation. As the world tries to break free of the shackles of the pandemic, hope and unity bring us together to heal our planet. This is our opportunity to learn from our past and move forward to the future. We hold the key to making our world a better place. If not us, who will step up to be the leader of tomorrow? Who will guide the way for a sustainable society? Who will be a beacon of hope for humanity? It is our responsibility to take the lead on global transformation. Through diplomacy and leadership, our views and ideas can open up new doors to find potential solutions to national and international challenges. Our choices and decisions can go a long way towards working to achieve global peace. It is us, the youths, who will draw the blueprint of a better world. With eight compelling committees and their eye-opening agendas, the three-day-long conference is giving you a chance to raise your voice and prove yourself to be a leader of the future. Break the boundaries with us and join the ultimate battle of diplomacy. BUP International Model United Nations Conference 2021. Let's strive for sustainability together.
It was an amazing representation of BUP Global Affairs Council. Let us now call upon the stage the man behind the conference. Give a big round of applause for the Secretary General of BUP IMUN 2021, Muhammad Nazmul Hassan Shapon. Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Deepu Moni, MP, Minister of Education, Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh. Respected Special Guest, Major General M. Moshfikur Rahman, SGP, SUP, NDC, PSC, Vice Chancellor, Bangladesh University of Professionals. Professor Dr. Khandukar Mukaddam Hussain, Pro Vice Chancellor, Bangladesh University of Professionals. Respected Deans, Faculty Members, Executive Committee Members, Executive Board Members, Delegates, my beloved Secretariat Members, and all the participants who have joined us through live broadcast, Assalamu Alaikum and a very good morning to you all. Being a part of BUP International Model United Nations Conference 2021 brings me a great joy and honor. It was encouraging to see the eager delegates discuss and think of diverse solutions to present global crisis. The theme of this conference was fostering the economy through technological advancement to tackle post-pandemic catastrophe. Each committee session has gone through a succession of resourceful and active sessions. Each committee session has the intelligence and vision of the delegates enrich the committee meetings with informative discussions about global issues to make this conference more dynamic. I'm delighted to see that BUP IMUN 2021 Secretariat has once again raised the bar with their outstanding work. Despite the pandemic, every member of the Secretariat worked relentlessly to ensure the mission was a success. They demonstrated their uniqueness by organizing Model UN Conference and ensuring that it functioned immaculately for three days. I warmly thank all the dedicated organizers for providing an opportunity to motivate youths to establish their inner potential. My heartfelt gratitude to all the national and international delegates for their enthusiasm and contribution to the success of this event. It's a privilege for me to be a Secretary General of this incredible event and to collaborate with the exceptional Secretariat members in terms of making a flawless conference. I hope that the names of BUP IMUN and BUP GC grow in the popularity over time. I look forward to seeing you all at BUP IMUN 2022. With this, I, Mohammad Nazmun Hassan Shapon, the Secretary General of BUP International Model United Nations Conference 2021, declared this conference closed. Thank you all. Thank you for your inspirational words and guidance throughout the whole conference. Now, we would like to call on stage our special guest, Major General Mohammad Mushfikur Rahman, Vice Chancellor, Bangladesh University of Professionals. Bismillah rahman rahim <coughs> Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Deepu Muni MP, Honorable Minister, Minister of Education, Distinguished Guests, Respected Deans, Faculty Members, Moderators, Officials, Executive Board Members, Secretary Members, and Delegates present here and connected to online. Assalamu alaikum and very warm welcome to all of you. Uh, at the very outset, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to our 
honorable chief guest for gracing this occasion, uh, despite her very, very busy schedule. I tell you, and you must have been following also the uh, media, national media, how busy is she? So thank you very much, sir, for attending the program. <clears throat> I would also like to thank the Dean of the Faculty of Security and Strategic Studies and Chairman of the Department of International Relations, the members and the club moderators of the BUP Global Affairs Council for organizing the event so well. BUP Model International uh, United Nations Program aims to raise awareness among youths on national and international events with a view to preparing them for future leaders, future leaders for our country. The theme for this year's conference focuses on the post-pandemic economic re recovery. And I consider the theme very timely as economic recovery agenda is dominating every recent happenings around the world. It is more pertinent for Bangladesh considering the need for, to maintain our progress momentum in order to reach our development goals. The growth trajectory set by our leadership has to be pursued relentlessly, overcoming the pandemic disruptions. Hope the discussions have acquired expected understanding on the need and importance, and as well the directions. COVID crisis has made us conversant with sayings like, no one is safe unless everyone is safe, or we are in it together. The same spirit and resolve remains equally relevant as we strive to recover from the disruptions caused by this pandemic. Here I would like to quote uh, the Chinese President Xi Jinping, uh, Xi Jinping, where he says, the pandemic proves once again that we live in one global village where countries stand to rise and fall together. That's how the uh, United Nations has to remain in the forefront, galvanizing the international community's effort. As per United Nations Conference on Trade and Development, UNTAD prediction, many developing countries will need several years to recover to the GDP per capita they had in nine, 2019. And for that, social and economic transformative measures are necessary to embark on a resilient and inclusive recovery from the pandemic. This will require an integrated approach at the national and international levels, including adequate financial resourcing. For developing countries like ours, shortfalls in digital infrastructure is indeed a big concern to shift from low value to higher value added areas. In this, in this regard, international community support for access to innovations and technology, green energy, would be of immense value. We should bear in mind widening digital divide and uneven speed of digital transformation badly hampers our effective participation in the global economy. There is also a need to maximize the potential role of regional trade and regional value chains as sources of development of national productive capacities. Our highest priority should be to expand our productive capacities to reach our development goals, foster growth, create unemployment, and develop infrastructure. Capabilities or capacities to produce vaccines, combat inequities, and addressing climate change deserve special attention. Human capital development would be crucial for long-term sustainable development. In this regard, ongoing emphasis on science and technology education by our honorable minister is definitely a move in the right direction. My special thanks to all the participants for their interest and enthusiasm. I take this opportunity to gratefully acknowledge the important contribution made by international students from Islamic University of Technology, Gajipur. Your Perspectives are of immense value. Hope we continue our journey in the coming days too. I do appreciate the support and contribution of our sponsors and partners making this event a success.
last but not least, I'm elated to be part of this conference where our dedicated students went above and beyond to ensure that everyone had a meaningful learning experience. I look forward to seeing our students even doing better in the coming years. Thank you, Honorable Minister, once again for inspiring us with your kind presence, and, 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 uh, even during these health restrictions. And wish you all health, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you, sir, for your motivational words. It's our honor and privilege to call upon the stage our honorable chief guest, Dr. Deepamoni, MP, Minister of Education, Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh. Respected Vice-Chancellor, respected Pro-Vice-Chancellor and Deans, distinguished guests, officials, faculty members, secretariat members, and dear participants, assalamu alaikum, and very good afternoon to you all. BUP International United Nations conferences have always provided the participants with a realistic stimulation of uh, realistic simulation of how genuine UN conferences are held and assisted them in learning about global issues. The theme of BUP iMoon uh, 2021, fostering the economy through technological advancement to tackle post-pandemic catastrophe is bound to assist today's youth to become more aware of current and emerging global challenges as well as inspire them to work for the country's future. I firmly believe the youth gained a better understanding uh, of the global situation as a result of this theme. Uh, as you are aware, the father of the nation, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, who himself was an idealistic and exemplary leader from his young age, believed that the youth should lead the way for the progress of their nation. Bangabundu wanted the youth of this country to develop themselves efficiently, uh, be aware of their responsibilities, and build a Shonar Bangla. Keeping his vision alive, our Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has made it one of her top priorities to help our future change makers achieve the goal of building a developed nation. For this reason, the government of Bangladesh is always trying to enhance and inculcate educational and professional skills among our youths and make them capable of facing the challenges of today's environment. Events like BUPI Immune uh, are emblematic of, the, of these goals and visions. Therefore, I would like to heartily congratulate the organizers of um, this event and the BUP Global Affairs Council on a job very well done. Even in the midst of the pandemic, it brings me great pleasure to see the students persevere in their endeavors despite the obstacles they face. Bangladesh University of Professionals has always been known for its high standards of discipline and excellence. I'm impressed by BUP's enthusiasm and precision in putting on such an event. Uh, I would like to, uh, I'd like to remember, recall the sacrifices, supreme sacrifices made by our language martyrs as we uh, assemble here today on the month of February. In 1952, they laid down their lives uh, to give us the right to speak in our own mother tongue. That movement started in 1948 and we are still struggling. We are still struggling with 
realizing their dreams. And I'm sure under the visionary leadership of Sheikh Hasina, we will achieve all those dreams, inshallah. I also recall with deep gratitude the father of the nation, the greatest Bengali of all times, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, who gave us this independent country. And I recall the sacrifices made by the martyrs of 1975, 15th of August. Remember, recall the contribution of the martyrs of 3rd November 1975, our four national leaders. Three million martyrs of our war of independence. Hundreds of thousands of women who were raped by the occupation Pakistani forces and their local collaborators. And all those who sacrificed their lives throughout our history for realizing the rights of the Bengali nation. Amadiri Deshta Jatir Pita Shadhin Kore Diege Chilen Tiri Shadhinatar Shapna Dekhiye Chilen Aki Shonge Muktir Shapna Dekhiye Chilen Amra Shadhinatar Pechi Muktir Pathe Jatra Shuru Kore Chilen Takoni Taanke Amadir Kach Teke Kere Dena Aya Hoi Chhe Shai Muktir Pathe Yamra Aakho Naachi Shai Obhi Jatra Yamra Aachi Bangabundhu Konnan Ne Chitte Bangabundhu Dekhano Pathe Ebon Ehi Muktir Obhi Jatra Aya Jara Ne Chitto Debe जब आमादेर के बंगबंधुर से शपने शुनार बंगला तोड़ी करे देबे, जब शे शपने जायगती ते आमादेर के पहुँचे देबे, तारा आज के तोरुन, आगमी दिने तोरुन, नुतुन प्रजन्म, तारा शुद्ध नीचे देश के जान ले हबे ना, तारा तो हबे विश्व नागरिक, तारा देशीर प्रति भालुवाशन ये बड़ो हबे, एकी शुंगे, तारा � जरा ये मॉडल यूएन करलो, तरा एक एक तो शुजोग मॉडल यूएनर, जहाँ मैं शुद्ध हमारे देश के नहीं भाभी, देश के बुची, देश के समस्या बुची ताना, बुशिक जो तो समस्या आते हैं, शेगुलो के वामी बुची एवं उन्नो देश के जायगाएँ दानिए, उन्नो देश की प्रायोरिटी, तार की पर्सपेक्टिव, शेटा I saw a placard, why Germany, why one country, 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 participate. So, but that country is a country, a country is a country, a country is a country, a policy priority is a country, a country 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 is a country, ए मॉडल यूएनर मध्य दिए करा है इसे जो ना मैं शब्द शब्द में शब्द जाएगा मौन करी जे आमादे रे तोरुन ने रा तारा जनो शुद्ध देशर मध्य ना है शरा बिश्चे तारा जनो बहुत शिक्षक समस्तो समस्या बोली नहीं है तारा अबोगतो थके अबोहितो थके एवं शेगुलो नहीं है तादेर ओ शब्दनों आते � तादिर पौरे उजाराज भी तादिर जुन्ने जैक्टर शुंदर पृथ्वी भी तारा तोड़ी करे रखे जाबे तार जुन्ने की पदक्षेप तादिर नीते हबे शेगुलो तारा शीख बे ये जो नेगोशिएशन एर एक तो चर्चा अनेक नेगोशिएट करता है ताई ना हैं कि जुते ही तो रेजोल्यूशन आशा जाए ना एकदम एक तो दुटो शब्दोनी आशुले ही जाती शंके आखिर जिनिश है प्रत्येक टक में जितने इरोकम को रही है और सुम्बु ब्रोको में शक्तो बक्तो नेगोसिएशन है शेगुलो आपने रहे जी मॉडल ही हुए ने शेखा रखते शुजो घुट से ये ठीक तो आपने दिल के तोड़ी कर चें शब भविष्य तेर जोने मुझे तो शुद्ध जाती शंके जोने ना जीवन एर एक जन दुखों जोगों मानुष है उड़बार पाते इट आपना दरके अनेक अनेक शाह जोगी तक कर बे कहाँ जमी उद्योग गुलों के अमी शागों तो जाना ही है बंग बांग्लादेश यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ प्रोफेशनल्स तादेव ए जी उद्योग गुलो प्रत्येक बच्चरी होते हैं उन ग्लोबल अफेयर्स काउंसिल ए जी ग्लोबल अफेयर्स 
মনে করিয়ে দেয় যে তুমি তোমার আশপাশে যা দেখছো শুধু তাই বিশ্ব নয় আরও অনেক বড় একটা পৃথিবী আছে একই সঙ্গে আমার আমরা যদি এটুকু একটু ভাবতে পারি যে আমরা আসলে পুরো বিশ্ব ব্রহ্মাণ্ডের তুলনায় আমরা এক একজন মানুষ আসলে কতটা ক্ষুদ্রাতি ক্ষুদ্র কাজে আমরা আজকে অনেক ইস্যু নিয়েই আমরা অনেক রকম দুঃখ কষ্ট চিন্তা দুশ্চিন্তা রাগ ক্ষোভ অনেক কিছুর মধ্য দিয়ে যাই অনেক রকম আবেগের মধ্য দিয়ে যাই একটু যখন একদম আটকে যাই তখন যদি এটুকু ভাবি বা আটকে যাবার জায়গায় পৌঁছবার আগেই যদি একটু ভাবি আমি মানুষ হিসেবে একজন মানুষ হিসেবে শুধু আমার এই পরিবেশের মধ্যে নয় আমি যদি পুরো বিশ্ব ব্রহ্মাণ্ড নিয়ে ভাবি আসলে আমার জায়গাটা কতটা ক্ষুদ্রাতি ক্ষুদ্র সেখানে এই বিষয়গুলোকে কতটা ধরে রাখব নাকি আমি একটা শান্তির পথ খুঁজব একটা সমৃদ্ধির পথ খুঁজব সবার জন্যে একটা উন্নততর বিশ্ব খুঁজব আমি আশা করি আমরা সবাই সেই পথেই ধাবিত হব ক্ষুদ্র ব্যক্তি স্বার্থ ক্ষুদ্র চিন্তা সংকীর্ণতা সেগুলো সব কিছু দূর হয়ে যাবে আমরা একটা শান্তির সাম্যের সৌহার্দের একটা বিশ্ব গড়ে তুলব এবং আমি বিশ্বাস করি সেই বিশ্ব আমাদের এই তরুণেরাই গড়ে তুলবে ইনশাল্লাহ এবং তাদের চিরন্তন অনুপ্রেরণার উৎস হয়ে থাকবেন একজন বঙ্গবন্ধু মুজিব আমাকে এই অনুষ্ঠানে আমন্ত্রণ জানাবার জন্য আমি আয়োজকদেরকে আমার আন্তরিক ধন্যবাদ এবং কৃতজ্ঞতা জানাই এবং সবাইকে আবারও অনেক অনেক শুভেচ্ছা আর আমি একেবারেই না পারতে অনিবার্য কারণেই আমার আসতে অনেক দেরি হয়ে গেছে অনুষ্ঠান শুরু করতে অনেক দেরি হয়েছে সে কারণে সবার কাছে ক্ষমা প্রার্থী আপনাদের সবাইকে ধন্যবাদ জয় বাংলা জয় বঙ্গবন্ধু থ্যাংক ইউ সো মাচ ম্যাম ফর ইউর ওয়ান্ডারফুল ওয়ার্ল্ড We'd like to request our Vice Chancellor to join our Chief Guest on the stage. The time has come for the award giving ceremony of BUP IMA Event 2021. Special mention for the committee of WTO goes to China. The outstanding delegate for the committee of WTO goes to Singapore. The special mention for the committee of UNICEF goes to Canada. The outstanding delegate for the committee of UNICEF goes to Sweden. The special mention for the committee of WHO goes to United Kingdom. The outstanding delegate for the committee of WHO goes to USA. The best delegate for the committee of WHO goes to Germany. The special mention for Jatiya Shangshud goes to Strom O Karma Shangstan Pratimantri. The Outstanding Delegate Award for the Committee of UNSC goes to the Delegate of Montenegro. The Best Delegate Award for the Committee of UNSC goes to the country of Albania. The 
the outstanding correspondent for the committee of UNNA goes to Mashafi bin Shafiq. The special mention of UNNA goes to Siraju Salihin. The best correspondent award of UNNA goes to Arafat Islam. The special mention of the Committee of DISEC goes to the Delegate of Singapore. The Outstanding Delegate Award for the Committee of DISEC goes to the Delegate of Montenegro. The Best Delegate Award for the Committee of DISEC goes to the Delegate of France. Now that we're done with the committee awards, let's move forward to the best delegation award. The best delegation award goes to Jinaida Cadet College. Moving on, the awards for our remarkable Charge D Affairs. Sharif Muhammad Moaz. Then comes our hardworking Deputy Director General, Shudeep B. Nivan. Moving forward to our phenomenal Director Generals, Tamanna Alam Lubaba. Hasibur Rahman Mahin. And last but not the least, Nahla Nawar. Now we'd like to extend a warm welcome to our Deputy Secretary General, Shahmid Islam Sharon. Please welcome our Secretary General, Muhammad Nazmul Hassan Shapon. Now, we would like to request our respected Vice Chancellor, Major General Mohammad Mushfikur Rahman, to hand over the crest of BUPGSE to our Chief Guest, Dr. Deepu Moni MP. We'd like to request all the Secretariat members to come up on the stage to join our Chief Guest for a group photo.
We'd like to request all to take their seats and ask the Chief Advisor of BUP Global Affairs Council to convey his vote of thanks. Honorable Chief Guest, Respected Vice Chancellor, Ladies and Gentlemen, Assalamu Alaikum. First of all, I would like to express my deepest thanks to our Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Dipumoni MP, Minister of Education, Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh, because this conference, which is the result of our innovation and efforts, would not be complete without her encouragement, wisdom and support. I firmly believe that our students will be highly inspired by her kind presence, being well aware of her years of experience as the former Minister of Foreign Affairs and the current Minister of Education of our country. I am also grateful to our respected Vice Chancellor, Major General Mohammad Mushfikur Rahman, SGP, SVP, NDC, PSC, for his kind encouragement in all of our endeavors. This conference would not have been successful without him guiding us in the right direction. My heartfelt gratitude goes to Shena Kollang Shangstha and Bangladesh Machine Tools Factory for their immensely valuable contribution to BUPI MUN 2021. I hope Bangladesh University professionals can work alongside them again in the future to make the world a better place for the next generation. It is a good thing that there are people willing to believe and fight for a brighter future for all of us. BUP International Model United Nations Conference 2021 represents the future of our efforts to recover from the pandemic and build a more resilient world. The youths are the next generation leaders who will build Shonar Bangla. It is amazing to see them taking a stand and raising their voices for the ideas they believe. The delegates and executive board members of this conference have done an exceptional job for addressing global crisis and generating potential solutions. Congratulations to the participants. Your valuable efforts to contribute to our society are beacons of hope for tomorrow. The Secretariat members and the moderators deserve my honest appreciation for your unwavering dedication. You have done everything you can in such a short span of time and in the midst of a pandemic to make this event exceptional. I hope BP Global Affairs Council continues to make a positive difference in the world for the years to come. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, sir, for your kind words. With this, the year's most anticipated event, BUP International Model United Nations Conference 2021, has come to an end. We are privileged and delighted to have our honorable chief guest, Dr. Deepu Moni, MP, and our esteemed special guests with here today. Your presence has not only added to the beauty of this occasion, but also motivated us to contribute and work harder for the country's future. We aim to follow the path paved for us by the father of our nation, Bongo Bondhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, and lead the world of tomorrow. We hope that you had an enjoyable time here at Bangladesh University of Professionals. Now we'd like to request all the guests to proceed for the working lunch. Assalamu alaikum and good, good afternoon. afternoon.